Merry Christmas everyone um, this is the month of December reading for the Aries Sun Moon Horizon sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back Aries I want to wish each and every person a Merry Christmas and um, please like and share these videos um, Christmas is going to be a time of giving if you'd like um, to send someone a gift you don't have enough money buy a reading for the person and send it to them use the link below to check out the on-demand reading and uh, um, I want to say thank you for your support this whole year thank you for the wonderful likes and share and your support let's see what is coming in for you Aries um, Aries wow we have four weeks into this month and this month is a water month you're a fire sign so hold on Aries alrighty so we have the magician in reverse Aries whatever is happening and transpiring we have the magician in the reverse whatever the issue is it's uh, um, in the first week for you guys the magician comes up in the reverse now when the magician comes up in the reverse that means if you are planning on doing something don't do it it's not yet time it's not going to be the right time so when the um, energy of the magician comes up it's always yeah it's a go ahead now in the, in the first week it's the energy of the air you're a fire sign you're vibrating with the energy of water be careful the Sun comes out in the second week whatever the issue was you didn't make a decision and an healing come in in the second week this is a fire sign this is going to be one of your best week areas so this is really really good so whatever that you were supposed to do in the first week you didn't make that decision you didn't go forward and do it in the second week it's going to be okay the third week justice comes in whatever the energy is justice comes in in the third week whatever that was transpiring there is the energy of justice that is coming in in the third week we're going to be looking if it's coming in your favor temperance is here in the fourth week this is an earth energy that is bringing balance because you have here in the first week second week you have the sun um first and second week and then you have temperance now what this is saying is that some of you here is could have had some issues some legal issues it didn't come out in your favor for some of you and this is why this energy is coming up but not to worry we're going to be seeing what is affecting so again whatever that was happening in your life um the universe was like saying in the first week don't make any move in the first week just sit back and look don't make any any move in the first week okay if you're having legal issues i'm seeing um the temperance coming after justice is not saying some of you um who was supposed to make a decision in the first week and didn't do it um it is going to be balancing out okay so i'm seeing that is going to affect the older people whatever um that is transpiring okay let's see what is coming up first we going in the second week we have the seven of swords some deceptiveness uh, that has transpired is going to come out so um the seven of, this is the energy that someone tries to get away with something but they didn't okay whatever was transpiring someone tried to get away with something but they didn't so um this could be the energy of uh, um um you were going to do something and it's as if the universe said no because if whatever you do it's gonna come out so um, whenever um, the magician come in reverse it's, it's, it's as if something that you're planning on doing is like don't do it because it's gonna come out whatever you try to do okay so um, that is a scene then we have the ten of swords being stabbed in the back um lies and deception whatever that was transpiring so you Aries you gotta be aware of what is transpiring um because there is um some deception that has transpired and whatever lies and deception it is now coming out so um Aries you gotta be aware of what is happening in the month of December because lies and deceptiveness is the center of your month then we have the three of pentacles i'm seeing people um trying to work with each other to resolve a situation um whatever it is i am seeing 
temperance is the energy of you finding balance to um, work on a situation to balance out the situation whatever that was happening and transpiring so however this is working or whatever is transpiring I'm seeing that people are going to be coming in to help you to balance out a, a deceptive situation that has transpired. Temperance, the energy of temperance and the three of pentacles is people, whatever deceptiveness, whatever unjust that was done, whether to you or someone did it to you, I am seeing that lies and deception is coming up in the month of December for you, Aries. So, so Some of you that some deceptiveness was done against, um, you're going to be coming out of it. Some of you were wishing and open for something that some deceptiveness would come to light. It is definitely going to be happening. Whoever has done you injustice and, 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 and deceptiveness, it's going to come to light. Okay. So, we're calling in on the angels of the Aries and Moon Horizon sign um, to um, show us what is coming up in the month of December, because there is some um, some some something that is happening, Aries, because you have the Ten of Swords. This is the quest. There is a quest. A result. A, um, a quest is going on where an investigation with something. And it's going to be coming out in the second week. Whatever is transpiring, there is a quest that is going on, an investigation to something. And it's going to be coming out in the second week. So Aries, whatever that you have done in the past, it is going to be coming out in the second week because a light is going to be shed on it. Some of you have some situation to do with some money. Whatever this deceptiveness that has transpired, because I'm seeing that some of you had done something deceptive against a Capricorn. Now I'm seeing an investigation is taking place uh, um, and uh, the Capricorn is going to have justice because the truth is going to come out about what has transpired. It's as if you Aries has lied over a Capricorn because I'm seeing the energy of the Capricorns here. It's as if uh, there is a, a deceptive situation between you and a Capricorn. I'm seeing an investigation is being taken place and they saw that you have used either the Capricorn information or whatever. However, because I'm seeing there is no one else except that there is uh, the um, Major O'Connor is coming in to resolve issues and situation. So whatever that was transpiring, and I'm seeing a, a young man, whoever this young person is, man or woman between the age of 18 and 45, is here. Um, and this um, young um, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn um, is showing up because they've done some deceptive things. And it's as if you and a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person have done some deceptive things and it's now coming out. So um, the quest is um, the quest is that uh, whoever this young person is that you have worked together with and whatever they have done, this is coming out now. So I am seeing that a Gemini could have done some deceptive thing. Um, and you have worked with a Gemini to do some deceptive things and it is now coming out because I'm seeing an investigation is taking place. Aries, whatever is transpiring in the middle, you're dealing with a Gemini. Okay. Some of you are dealing with a Gemini. Some of you are dealing with a Capricorn. Whatever all of this that is transpiring, this Gemini, this Capricorn, um, this Taurus person, I'm seeing an investigation is coming um, to a, a Gemini, a, a young person. Um, and whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing it has to do with uh, 
some of you use this person information or took some money or something from this person and it is now coming out because the center of your money month is the ten of swords so um aries whatever is happening and justice is there and there is an investigation that is taking place some of you are going to be receiving help from a capricorn to bring a situation in balance um it depends on who you are or you could be uh, um, receiving yeah help from a group of people but it's like help uh, from a group of people trying to balance out what has transpired for you aries so you know it's um this is the first time i've ever seen the ten of swords in the middle of a month i seems to be a little bit pro um um perplexed but i'm perplexed because of this and whatever at transpire you have done some injustice against um this energy because it's as if you took something for someone that wasn't for you and it could be vice versa so it's not only for you aries it is as if you took something or someone took something from you that was yours and um what you call it and like um uh, take um um but it has to do with money it has to be with money however way some deceptiveness has transpired where money is here and it has to do with capricorns it's as if you and someone you and a virgo it's not coming up as a virgo it's coming up as a gemini you and a gemini did something that was very deceptive and it's as if an investigation is 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 happening now and it is coming out so let's see so we have the queen of swords in reverse so it is the energy of the gemini so this could be the energy of one um and, and uh, aquarian gemini or libra they came down and see what the deceptiveness that has transpired in the beginning of december what has happened and what has transpired um the energy of a new love lies and deception some of you have met someone new and it's a lot of lies and deception with this new love so whoever this new love is and whoever is coming in your lies in your life there is a lot of lies and deception and this person could um truths are coming out because whoever this new love is it's a young person in your life or it can be a new person some of you are going to be finding out that your kids have been lying lies and deception from your kids then we have the energy of the cups um, this is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person and I'm seeing justice coming down on this person so some of you could have been dealing with um, a cancer a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person and I'm seeing justice coming down on this lady because of something that they found out that she has done I'm seeing whatever this investigation is all about if it's about a house if it's about something at work something deceptive that has transpired at home and at work I'm seeing this coming in some deceptive things that has transpired um, for some of you the old people is at work and some of you the younger people so whatever it is this deceptive things happen at work or happen at home I'm seeing an offer is going to be coming in and this offer is as if they're saying okay we find you guilty but we're offering you this okay so some of you could be receiving an offer there is some huge lies and deceptiveness that has transpired now it has to do with two people um this is a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius and a young Taurus Virgo or a can Taurus and Virgo person these two people have done some deceptive things and it's going to be coming out so you young people between the age of 18 and 45 you have worked with um, a, a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person everything is about to come out and I'm seeing justice is here and is going to be looking at the issue lies and deception 
um, and this lies and deception, whatever that is going on, the energy of uh, it's over money, money, um, assets, property, money, assets, and property. Okay. Money, assets, and property. And I'm seeing some of you are going to be walking away from this because the truth comes out about what has really transpired. The truth comes out about what has really transpired. And you're walking away from this thing and you're saying, you know, I am letting this be. Whatever is transpiring, I'm letting this be. And, and, you know, some of you older people are going to be standing back and you have to definitely release um, whatever, whether it's a business or whether it's a, a house or whether it's something that you have acquired using someone else's information, you have to stand back from, from it. So we are seeing a situation with a house and I'm seeing um, that you're standing back from this thing. It's, it's, it definitely is a house and some of you are dealing with an issue with a house and work and house and work. Some of you is a house, some of you is a work. Whatever that is there, whatever that is transpired, whatever that is happening, it is there coming up for you guys. Okay. Then we see a resolution is going to be coming in. Um, definitely a resolution and it has to do with a house because I'm seeing um, it's a situation with a house a resolution is definitely go going to be coming in so whatever that has happened there is some deceptiveness um, and it has to do with situation at work where some of you are trying to find balance dealing with this deceptiveness um, that you're dealing with at work so it is really I've never seen this before in Aries. It's it's um it's it's a little bit of a uh, custard up because I'm seeing strong foundation, but yet still I'm seeing um because it's good for a lot of you Aries. I should say that it's good, especially people Aries that was dealing with a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion. I'm seeing this is very good. Whoever the Pisces Cancer or Scorpion is, I'm seeing this is very good. Some of you. Um, could have worked with this person and seen justice coming down on this person for something that this person has done and could, could have created for you. I'm seeing um, some of you are going to be receiving an offer, um, but whatever this offer is, is as if um, you're like, no, um, or you're like, okay, whatever. Um, I, I, I don't think I should have gotten this, you know, I, because I've gone through so much. So this is what is coming up. But for some of you who have definitely used someone information, breaking a house, access someone, telephone, um, internet, um, use their cards, use their name to get a cards and that sort of a thing. I'm seeing you really coming in some serious, serious problem and um whoever and whatever is transpiring i'm seeing a success is coming um against a pisces cancer or a scorpion now there is an older virgo that you're connected to and i'm seeing not a very um good um outcomes for this person because this person could have done something um before and was never caught whoever this um this person is a woman 45 years and older who is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. You could have worked with this person or you could have asked this person to do something. And whatever has transpired is that uh, they're going to find out that this person has done something before and never, it never came up. And what is going to be transpiring basically is that they are going to be picking up this person for something that they have done. So this person is going to be moved away because there is an investigation that is going to be happening to this older woman. She's an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. Whether she works with you or she's your partner, she has done something deceptive in the past and they're going to be finding out. So she and this um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion woman have done something together and uh, they, because your month is as if you're going to be telling the, about the lies and deception especially the young people are going to be telling about the lies and deception and i'm seeing that you had this woman that is a pisces cancer scorpion hop and this is a, a um 
a cancer woman of a Pisces cancer scorpion up but it's as if now you're spilling your guts over this woman so if you're young between the age of 18 and 45 I see you had the Pisces cancer scorpion woman on the top and now you're spilling your guts and they're going to be paying you or they're going to be offering you yet yeah, um, if you tell us about this Pisces cancer scorpion woman it is going to be balanced out for you but if you um yeah then you get a, um, like I'm, I'm a lower sentence or something like this or a lower um, yeah we help you to uh, research this but whoever this person is I'm saying that definitely definitely um, a change is coming and a change is coming with this person so you got to be aware because because of this person for you young Aries um, there was situation for the rest of you I'm saying that it's going to be lies and deception is going to be coming out so the rest of you if there was some lies and deception with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it's all going to be coming out there was some deceptiveness with a cancer in a corporation organization and I'm seeing that this is all coming out and uh, there is an investigation against uh, a cancer a Taurus Virgo and a Capricorn and you Aries people are going to be spilling especially the young Aries I'm seeing you caught up with these three other people and you're going to be spilling and saying exactly what has happened and exactly what has transpired so um be aware of this what is happening the camel boy is here the energy of the camel boy small steps ask for help small steps ask for help so the energy of the camel boy is here small steps ask for help whatever is happening in this month of december it's small steps ask for help I'm asking you guys to share these videos it is uh, so weird um, because a lot of people do not understand what it is and the energies and why you are here please like and share these video um, check out um, check out the readings uh, for the new year that is going to be coming up full moon reading is going to be coming out I want to say to you Aries thank you so much for supporting my channel all these years for all the people who have been going with me remember these are general readings do not take it personal a lot of people are taking these readings personal and it doesn't have effect it doesn't affect everyone it's just a small group of people who are dealing with special special uh, specific people and this is why you need to um, go and uh, cross watch cross was to see who is this lady she's a Pisces cancer and a scorpion 45 years and older she has something to do with work some deceptiveness that has happened at work um, look for these people if you are in a relationship with a, with a with a Capricorn if you're in relationship with a Capricorn a businessman a Taurus Virgo a Capricorn person a businessman if you're in relationship with this person um, look for a um, uh, because whatever is transpiring I'm saying the quest the quest is someone between the age of 18 and 45 that some of you are dealing with and an older woman um, that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius so if you have people and situation that is connect go cross watch to find out the um, Aquarius Gemini and Libran and who is a Pisces Cancer and Scorpion and who is the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn that you have to deal with okay because I'm seeing you here especially the young people the outcomes is that the quest of material this is a, um, a young entrepreneur and you're turning your back because you're spilling your guts and telling what has to inspire I love you guys um, the uh, extended region is down below please like and share namaste Merry Christmas